Forty Braywood is probably the most exciting house that I've ever been in. It was designed with nature as its primary element. So when you walk in any room, you basically see the outdoors. They had so many architects on this, you know, that Graham Greene, the main architect who won an AIA award for this house. Then they had a lighting architect and they had a landscape architect and an interior designer and then of course the builder was Joe Kane, who is phenomenal, he does great work. This lot is situated on the creek. It's in Glen Abbey and it's on the estate side, which means it's a, a lot of land. It's 1.05 acres, but really when you count all the way to the creek, it's an acre and a half. And then there's 10 acres beyond it. When you walk in the front door, the first thing that came to my mind was, and a river runs through it. Really, who has a creek that runs under your house and comes out the other side? It's incredible. My favorite spaces are probably the media room, which is also a library. With the push of a button, you turn it into a media room. The black velvet curtains close and the screen comes down. It's very heavily insulated for sound abatement. I love the rooftop deck. Sitting out there with a glass of wine in the evening, you truly do feel like you're in the hill country. What about the master suite? I think one of the coolest features to talk about though that nobody has. When she gets up on her side of the bed and steps on the floor, it sets off certain lighting to light her way to her powder bath. The living room with its close to 30 foot ceilings, floor to ceiling glass, again, you look out one of the five water features on the property, the biggest waterfall. I mean, it just really takes your breath away and the natural products that they have in the house. I've never seen a house where it really took advantage of nature like it did. Kitchen is, I think, really truly ahead of its time with the stainless steel countertops all the way around it for prep area. It's got so many bells and whistles in it, but it's pretty as well. Well, the wine room itself, it holds 2,000 bottles and it's down at the bottom of the spiral staircase, but it also has elevator access. So if you're taking down cases of wine, you can use the elevator. That spiral staircase is a work of art. The builder and the architect referred to it as the spine of the home. It's really probably the most outstanding feature of the home. It was built by a shipbuilder in Wisconsin. It was shipped to Dallas in pieces and assembled. It's just striking, but when you get to the very top, to the rooftop deck, which is the fourth floor, you can look down through the center and there is a, a statuary holding gems and crystals that's uplit. One of the most eye-catching things to me is that negative edge pool. It was written up in May by D Magazine, so it is pretty fascinating. It's got a negative edge on two sides, and you know, the negative edge pools have to have a trough for the water to go in. They filled their trough with crushed black rock, so the water looks like it's just going into the ground, but it's really going into a trough that you just can't see it because it's all that black rock. It's real special. The drive up appeal on this house is really subtle. When they built this house, I don't think the architectural committee of this uh, gated community, they weren't doing anything contemporary. And I think they really had to modify the front where it did not really translate as contemporary as the house is. But I think one of the most special things that you, when you get out of your car, immediately getting on the sidewalk, you have a little creek running along next to you. I mean, who has that? Who would make a great resident? You know, this neighborhood is known for having a lot of top executives, uh, major corporations, athletes, people that really crave privacy. This is a 24-7 guarded gatehouse. I see it being somebody pretty sophisticated that has a real sense of taste. I had somebody tell me recently that mansions are a dime a dozen, but homes this special are very, very unique.